The found footage genre of movie is a very small but interesting genre of film. I think of Blair Witch Project as probably being one of the, the first movies to really incorporate the idea that somebody found this footage and made it into a movie. Uh, also, uh, Cloverfield was that way, and most recently, the movie I saw this weekend, Apollo 18, is a found footage movie. The idea of the footage in this case is that it's the space program finally releasing uh, a lot of this footage uh, and making it into a movie so you knew what happened to this super, super secret uh, mission, Apollo 18 mission that went into space. Really, this is uh, probably the poorest found footage movie I've ever seen in that there are a couple things, and I don't want to give a lot away, I guess. I guess some of this could be considered spoilers, but I don't understand how there's any legitimacy if, let's say, you wanted to believe this was found footage. I don't think you could watch this movie and at the end of it go, oh yeah, I see how they could have found that and put that together. It just doesn't make any sense. The camera angles, the amount of film, where they got the film, all of those things just don't work in this movie. Really what this movie is, is a suspense shock movie. It's 5, 10, 15 minutes of not much happening, followed by one split second of boop, gotcha. And that happens over and over and over again in the movie. There's an interesting little concept behind kind of what they're talking about with the moon and what's scary on the moon and what might happen there, but is nowhere near enough to make this movie anything worth uh, spending time with. If, especially if you are one of those people that get um, that don't like kind of those jump scenes where something comes out and scares you, do not see this movie. It really is just one jump scene after another, after another, after another. Uh, kind of creepy and spooky, and uh, it, it, it tries to be suspenseful, but I think just becomes boring, and that's really unforgivable in a movie like this. It is uh, one that I, I would just stay away from. I don't even think you need to see it when it's on home video. Um, maybe go see The Help for a second time instead of seeing Apollo 18.